Hello, Sambro families. Just wanted to introduce you to our classroom for music at Sambro School. This is our beautiful room where we have music um, two days a week, Wednesdays and Fridays in the mornings uh, for half an hour each time for primary to five. This is our choir bulletin board. Uh, all of our choir members' names will be up here along with their songs that they are singing. Our choir is for grades two to five. Up here, I post every, well, I write to every song that we sing for the month. For September, we focus on singing. For each month, we have a different focus and all of this is, should be in your handout for curriculum night. You can always email me if you have any questions. These are all of our beautiful instruments that we have at our school. We take turns with each of these throughout the year. This is our music literacy corner. So students will learn a reading song per month, and they will write the rhythm and the solfa throughout the month. At the end of the month, we usually do a bit of group work where they do that kind of thing on their own and then play the song, a simple song. This is our recorder's corner for grade three, four. Grade five and four, so grade four, five, are playing ukuleles, which are down here. And recorder and ukulele will go for the first term, so until Christmas. And then we get to do something else in case they're unsure, finding it tricky. It's nice to have something different afterward. This is our beautiful bulletin board that all the students have participated in putting together. We have peace, love, music in everyone's hands. For assessment in music class, uh, it's generally participation. So for every class, I have a class list. I check off if a student is singing, clapping, playing instruments, if they're, try if they're trying their best. If, you're, if a student is refusing, that's really the only time that maybe there wouldn't be a check mark for that class. So it's, it's based on participation. We do sometimes have more formal assessment uh, in the upper grades after first term, we'll have maybe a test on instruments or a test on Mi'kmaq music or a test on African music, just, just a different way of assessing so that students get a chance to show in different ways. Sometimes it's better for students who are a little bit shy. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to email me. That's usually the best way to get a hold of me because I have other schools that I go to um, throughout the week. Uh, and my email should be on the school website. Thanks so much. Take care.